Hey everybody, it's Rick Burnett here from Erogenous Tones, and I wanted to introduce to you a new module we have coming out later this year that will be at Moogfest, and it's called Mother's Little Helper. And this is it right here, and I'll just go through some of the features that it has. Um, it's running right now, uh, so that you can see what it's good for, and um, and what we thought would be good features to add that uh, people have been requesting for the Mother 32. So, first and foremost, you've got a little readout screen here that shows two different modes. There's a LED on each side to indicate which mode it's in. So if we switch to the upper mode, you see there's a number. If we rotate this control, we get between 1 and 16. These are all the assign settings. So if you go to assign 2, hit the button, what we're sending out of the assign output of the, the uh, Mother 32 is, uh, in this state, it's the clock coming out. And if you go to 3 and hit it again, 3 is like a divide by 2 coming out of the Moog. So there's a input that you can trigger this and also a CV, so if you want to switch between values with a sequencer, you could do that. All right, so switching back to the other mode, you see we've got two numbers and two little dots. The dots indicate that's the currently loaded thing. So the upper knob, you change that, changes the bank, one through eight, and the bottom knob switches the preset. So if we go to two and hit this, now we're playing sequence two. So this jack right here is actually the latching value for latching both the bank and the preset setting based on these. Again, if you plug a CV value into both and crank it all the way up, you can switch between banks and everything with a sequencer. So we go, I'll go to three, hit it again. Now I'm playing a different preset inside. Now, the other thing you'll see here, if I remove this, notice that the sustain is on. Now the sustain is off. So there's a MIDI control for controlling uh, the sustain. So what I'm doing is I'm using the assign out, which is a divided clock, to turn that on and off. And it's a latching type thing. So every time you, you hit it, it changes value and stays. Hit it again switches off and stays so you can latch it on and then off. Alright, so the final section of everything is a sample and hold circuit. So you've got an input coming in over here, this is your output, and this is what is um, you being used to sample. So it's a gate to trigger converter, so right now it is being fed off the square wave output of the LFO. So if I increase the LFO, you can hear it. And what I have it doing right now as well is going through the mixer to use it as a level control of how much I want to apply. So I'm going to apply all of it now. And it's controlling the LFO of the filter. So I'm going to crank up the frequency. So now I'll crank up the LFO. And it's sampling from noise. And there you have it. There's Mother's Little Helper, which is an absolute lot of fun to play with. MIDI jack connects out and uh, into the Mother 32 directly. I've got a couple uh, board changes to make, but uh, we're just about ready to go into production for this, and the code is just about done. Um, as you can see, i got everything functioning, so uh, if you have any questions, let me know, and thanks for taking a listen.